From an early age, Maddox faced challenges in managing his impulsiveness, behavior, and his big emotions. And these difficulties began to significantly disrupt his school life and the majority of the moments spent at home with his family. So when I met Maddox's mom, she had a single overarching goal for Maddox to experience happiness and ease within his own body. She wanted his vibrant personality to be the most memorable aspect about him, not the defiance and all of the disruptive behavior. So Maddox's parents tried everything to help him. They did the dietary changes, therapies, medications, various other avenues, but challenges still persisted and mom couldn't shake the feeling that there was just more going on within his body. So Maddox's story happens to so, so many, and usually it results in numerous doctor visits and can end up with a diagnosis of Oppositional Defiant Disorder, or ODD. From there, the doctor may recommend mood stabilizer medications such as Abilify or Risperdal, which come with a long list of nasty side effects and they just tend to mute personality. So as a parent, you can feel stuck not wanting your child to continue to struggle and severely disrupt life for your entire family, but also not wanting to put them on those hard hitting medications. And that's where neurologically focused chiropractic care comes in. I'm Dr. Sam, a pediatric chiropractor here at Foundations Chiropractic, and our team is here to help with these. We've been helping kids and adults handle their neurological challenges without medications, and we'll break down the science, the neurology, and the action steps of that process here in our video. So today's video is for moms and dads, just like Maddox is, who've tried everything, they're overwhelmed, they have not been given alternative choices that are congruent with their values. So we'll go over our explanation on how the stress and symptoms that are diagnosed as ODD, they add up years before, from early on in life and throughout development. We dive deep into the perfect storm, which explores how early and frequent stressors in a child's life can negatively affect brain development and lead to behavioral and emotional struggles that many kiddos with ODD share. So you've probably heard about ODD and its behavioral challenges, but have you ever wondered what might be going on beneath the surface within the brain and the nervous system that could be causing those responses and those behaviors? That's exactly what we're gonna dive into today. So to better understand ODD, we need to look closer at the contributors and the triggers that make up this nervous system response. Nearly every child in existence experiences a series of stressors that happen early on in life. From the time they're in the womb to the early years, these stressors can have a profound impact on brain development and function, and they're characterized by an imbalanced nervous system where the sympathetic or fight or flight response dominates. And the presence and severity of this imbalance often varies in conjunction with the frequency and severity of the stressors. Meaning, if your pregnancy was stressful or challenging, if you had trauma experience at birth via C-section or vacuum extraction, if they struggled with colic, constipation, if they experienced falls, or were exposed to stressful family dynamics in the home, the odds of that child's nervous system being stuck in a prolonged stress response increases greatly. So the physical stress from the birth process especially impacts the upper neck, specifically the vagus nerve, which is a vital part of the parasympathetic branch of the autonomic nervous system. This nerve, it regulates functions like heart rate, digestion, the stress response, social engagement, and emotional regulation. Some studies have suggested that abnormalities in autonomic nervous system function, including vagal tone, may be linked to behavioral problems and emotional dysregulation that is seen in children with disruptive behavior disorders like ODD. If this nervous system imbalance continues past birth in the form of struggles with early development, so with things like eating, sleeping, digestion, motor development, or with immune system struggles like ear infections, cough, croup, etc., and then it also carries into grade school with behavioral and emotional stressors, it all adds up and impacts the central nervous system. When this all happens together and over a long period of time, we call this the perfect storm. And the perfect storm is simply when all of the stress and struggle creates a significant imbalance of input from the body to the brain. Thus, ODD is often associated with a significantly imbalanced and dysfunctional nervous system. So while it's normal for kids to test boundaries, have behavioral challenges, when these patterns persist for years, it could be a sign of abnormal development. And ODD isn't just a condition with one single cause, it's complex, it's multifaceted. And that's why it's crucial to have a healthcare professional who understands the role of the CNS and its dysfunction while addressing the ODD. 
If your child is struggling with ODD, there's no doubt you've tried everything, but the recommendation I'll talk through today is to work through your healing journey in the correct sequence. If the communication in the brain and nervous system are imbalanced, start there at the root cause and then work forwards. Balancing the nervous system first will allow the brain to better activate that rest, relax, digest neurology, which is the opposite of what those who are struggling with ODD are experiencing on a daily basis, which is a constant fight or flight neurological response. This is exactly how it went with Maddox. He is now a thriving, happy, and energetic dude who is a blast to be around. He's having fun and he can finally experience life to the fullest. His family's integrated chiropractic into their lifestyle, really, and it has now become so in tune with what Maddox's body needs. Mom even tells us that she can tell when he's due for an extra adjustment to help his nervous system regulate when life just gets a little bit extra stressful. How cool is that? If you've got questions about neurologically focused chiropractic care or how it can help with ODD, please ask any questions or leave us a comment below. Send us a DM. Second, please share with other parents, family, Facebook groups who need this information. You've got this, we've got you.